In this video, we're taking a look at the SRAM Eagle NX 12-speed group set. So first off, before we get into the parts, let's go ahead and take a look at how it shifts. So I have this installed on a bike here. You can see that it's shifting through super smooth. It's going through the gears just like a higher level Eagle derailleur would. This is something we've come to expect because SRAM does a really great job of bringing the price point down without diluting the shift quality. You can see it's shifting through really well even as it gets up to that big 50 tooth. It's doing a good job of managing the chain and holding on nice and tight. It's also going to shift down super smooth. You'll notice on the cassette when we take a look at it, there's nice etchings and markings for the chain to both shift up and shift down and it does a really great job. So after checking that out, let's go ahead, see about each piece. So to start off a of video here, we'll take a look at the new NX derailleur. So this NX derailleur from SRAM, this is a really nice piece, especially considering the low cost for this derailleur. So this derailleur itself, uh, this is a true eagle derailleur. If you take a look at it, it looks really similar to the SRAM GX. Uh, it's just a little bit heavier. You can see there's a few more parts made out of plastic. Things like the cage here, instead of having aluminum, it's all made out of steel. And it runs a 14 tooth lower pulley. So this uses SRAM's X-Horizon uh, parallelogram. That allows it to track with all 12 speeds of this drivetrain. And then it's got an offset upper pulley to be able to wrap around everything from a 10 tooth all the way up to a 50 tooth. And that's no small feat on its own. And this is all cast aluminum or uh, it's got plastic and then a little bit of steel. Now, of course, this does have a cage lock mechanism to it. Uh, and that's nice to be able to lock this in place, make it easier to take on and off your rear wheel. Next up, we'll take a look at the Descendant Crank from Truvative. So Truvative is owned by SRAM, and in fact, this is kind of the, the SRAM Eagle equivalent. This would be really similar to looking at their NX Eagle, and it's gonna be available in the power spline setup like this, or in an Eagle dub setup, which is their new bottom bracket standards. So if we take a look at the back here, you can see we've got one, two, and three bolts. Those are to be able to remove and replace this direct mount ring. This is the Eagle ring, so it's got X-Sync 2 technology on it, uh, which is a really nice feature to have. And the crank arms themselves are gonna be nice and light and work super well. Next up is taking a look at the SRAM NX chain. Uh, this chain, as you can see, is a little bit different than the GX and the X1 chains. So this uses solid links uh, and solid pens. It can be set up with the same SRAM Eagle profile. So the shifting is all gonna set up and work pretty well. And it is backwards compatible with any other Eagle setup. You'll also notice uh, that this does use the flow link like you find in the other Eagle group sets, that kind of half moon shaped uh, quick link. Finally, let's take a look at the cassette. So if we look at the cassette here, uh, it's kind of the neat part of this group set. So the first thing, of course, is actually going to be this huge four cog set. This goes all the way up to the 50 tooth cog, all the way down to a 32. So this has your four steps, 50, your 42, your 36, 32, all stamped to an aluminum carrier. This is gonna help save some weight because each of these four cogs, these are actually all steel cogs on the aluminum spider. Past that, you're gonna go through each of the additional cogs, so your remaining eight, these are all going to be individual. So these will go right onto the free hub body. And what makes this really unique compared to some of the other Eagle setups is that this cassette itself is actually compatible on any 8, 9, or 10 speed free hub body that's set up for a standard SRAM or a Shimano cassette. 
So it's going to go onto that HG driver instead of the XD driver that's used on the GX cassettes and above. This cassette is backwards compatible with any of the other Eagle group sets. So while you give up the 10 tooth in favor of an 11 to fit on that HG free hub body, you still get the huge range all the way up to that 50 tooth. Thanks so much for watching this video on the SRAM NX Eagle group set. This is a super cool, brand new, budget 1x12 group set for your bicycle. Let me know down in the comments below what you think about this group set. And of course, be sure to click that like button if you enjoyed the video and click the subscribe button so you can see more videos like this into the future.